Um, so we've been hearing a lot about Facebook lately and fake news and how the algorithms optimize for clicks make us yeah. sort of love anything with a really exciting headline, even if that headline isn't exactly real. But on the other hand, you know, people have always been saying fake things. They've always been telling their friends fake stories. Um, it seems like there's a possibility that Facebook just allows us to quantify that more. How real do you think the fake news problem is? It's a real problem. And it's, it's exactly what I was saying before. I said that you, know, you have to optimize to something. Now, in the case of you know, old school media, like the New York Times or the Wall Street Journal, we didn't all agree. But at least they had a policy in, in mind to um, attempt to optimize to the truth. Um, in Facebook's case, they are using an algorithm. They are explicitly only doing things algorithmically. They're optimizing to, to user engagement, which, uh, of course, which like, is almost exactly the same thing as profit. Mm -hmm. um, and what they're not thinking about and they're like having basically a blind spot around is the question of truth. And that, that's one of the reasons that they have, there's so much discussion and so much you know, um, distance that they're putting themselves between themselves and, the, and re editorial responsibility because they explicitly do not want to optimize to the truth. They want to stick to their, their profitable optimization. Right, sometimes the fake headlines get a lot of clicks, a lot of it, likes. It gets a lot of engagement and yeah. it, it takes advantages of our human biases. Mm -hmm. So if they changed their design, if they changed their, the way they did business, they could probably change that. Right. Um, they could probably promote a civil conversation, a civil discourse and a real exchange of ideas. But that's not what has happened and it's so, I, so far, I don't see anything changing. Right. So Zuckerberg did come out with uh, a new set of rules, I think, to, to kind of address the problem. Do you think it goes far enough? I haven't seen a, any set of rules that involve human beings yeah. um, as, as final arbiters. And the truth is, our artificial intelligence, our machine learning algorithms, they are not very good. They mm -hmm. cannot distinguish between well-crafted lies and truth because they're not as smart as people. Um, they're good at playing Go and chess but they're not good at distinguishing between something that seems true and something that is true. So until I hear Zucker saying, we're gonna hire all the journalists that we've put out of work, I won't be very impressed. Mm -hmm.